you guys welcome back today i see that y'all are liking the videos of uh, my surprise guest <laughs> thank you i know we look alike stop telling me that shit <laughs> and um um i'm glad so just so y'all know you know most of the stuff that we you know and i've been meaning to do a video about this but a lot of the stuff that we do especially when it's black content black people content it does not get monetized so please if you can afford to any th any any donation is is worth and it, it it's worth it you know one dollar ten cents i don't care you know please look at those um check out those financial you know support handles if you really do fuck with me and you know you really like what i do and stuff and i definitely want to branch out more with the music and with the youtube so definitely if you can extend your support definitely a dollar ten cents whatever anything helps <coughs> you know a penny a day and all that stuff but nonetheless you know moving on from that um where to today i'm actually some of the people are great uh, i'm excited for this video i'm excited for this video to finally be the end you know after this i'll do when they finally come out with the sentence i'll or maybe i'll just post it on instagram i don't know but today the judge has convicted Jelani Mirage of sexually assaulting his 11-year-old stepdaughter. You know, this case has been going on a couple years. Blogs have been being quiet about it. And uh, uh, this year, apparently, they just now want to report on it. You know, most blogs have been being quiet, at least. You know, um, we suspect that they have been getting paid by Tiki Sudaj, but we're not going to say nothing about that. <laughs> <laughs> But, um, nonetheless, um, you know, they had the whole drama with her allegedly uh, speaking there and then the, the alleged claims of the $25 million, and then them bringing up the child's, you know, sexual history and trying to, just trying to make her look like a monster. And it just, it really, it was disgusting, but it's nice to see that justice is finally being served. And I'm not going to keep this video too long, you know, um... I spoke on, you know, my situation and how with my situation, it was just that he said, she said, and it was pretty much over, you know. So I'm glad that they didn't overlook evidence or try to, you know, undermine stuff because it's Nicki Minaj's brother. You know, I don't care if it's Joe Blow down the street or if it's, it doesn't matter. You know, this is child pedophilia, you know, or pedophilia. This is, this is child sexual abuse, you know. And, um, nonetheless, he's looking at about 25 years, anywhere from 25 years to life, you know, holding my fingers and crossing my fingers for life. Because anybody that can look at a child and just, like, that's just, most adults don't have sex four times a day. And he was forcing that girl to do everything and more. So, you know, it's just, it's a horrendous thing. You know, some of the barbs are mad and saying, you know, evidence can be misplaced and stuff. I don't know how your cum ends up on, and I don't like saying that word. So if I say that, you know I'm keeping it real with you in conversation. But um, I don't know how that stuff ends up on pajama pants and gets mixed in with the laundry. Um, that, that, make, that, that makes no sense. Most people eject, like being logical. And for me, approaching it, playing devil's advocate from a logical standpoint, you know, when when I touch myself, I don't have clothes on. So I, I, I don't know how you, you got it on your clothes. And, you know, so that, that never made sense to me. Um, them trying to bring up the girl's sexual history and saying she slept with other guys, that was victim blaming. So, you know, at that point, I had decided in my mind, I know he did it. I know he did it, you know. But him to try to say the mother is fixing up the son to say this and fixing up, you know, it's just evil and it's manipulative. And he looks, you know, I, I hate to say it, but he looks like a child molester. So, I mean, you know, it, it fits him. You know, that, that man just looks disgusting. But nonetheless, um, like a, like not, well, I mean, yeah, he looked disgusting look-wise, but I'm talking about he looks like a disgusting, he just, ugh. But nonetheless, um, he's looking at 25 years to life. I may come back and do an official video when we find out the time. The, um, that he will be serving the official time, but, um, yeah, I'm just glad that justice was served, and, you know, this girl and her mother, and, and this mother and her family can, you know, move on, 
and I hope that this girl can just, you know, I hope she can keep her head straight, you know, and get the help that she needs therapeutically, and, and, and you know, keep a clear mind, you know, and not lose her sight of her goals and, her, you know, her studies and stuff, because, you know, that shit is important, you know, and it's sad that, you know, when this happens to people, most people, they have to have that, you know, keep it, keep on going stage, you know, so I hope her and her mom find a good way to just move on from the past and everything that that monster did, and, um, I think that's about all I had to say on the situation, you know, it's unfortunate, but, you know, one thing to take from this is definitely, you know, all my, for all my parents that watch, I do watch my analytics, and I see I actually have a lot of 20, my most highest range is 25 to 34, so at that point, I'm assuming you're looking to lay down or settle down with somebody if you are, you know, if that's the life that you want to live, you know, be careful, you know, especially for the people who don't, who already have kids, so who are looking for stepdads and stepmoms, be careful who you're remarrying to or even marrying to in the first place, you know, do thorough backups, you know. Um, I don't, I don't believe in the last time I, even the last time I went on a date and I'm, uh, this was a while ago. I Facebook uh, everything about the girl. I Facebook, I look her up, you know, you can never be too careful nowadays. You know, people are crazy and you know, you definitely, you know, I, I feel like there had to have been some signs and maybe she just missed them. Maybe she didn't want to see them or maybe she just, maybe she just honestly missed them, but Nonetheless, you know, be careful with who you lie down with, you know, and always, especially if you have children in the mix, check with your kids. Is everything okay? You know, this, that, and the other, you know, because she was the one who was working. He was not working, and that's what eluded everyone, including myself, to assume that Nikki is the one who put up the houses and paid this and sold that because keeping it real, I don't know what Mama Carol does, but I know she has two songs out, you know, her two songs and what money they did make versus Nicki Minaj's repertoire of of making money, you know, I'm pretty sure he paid, those are the same, if I'm not mistaken, I heard those are the same lawyers that um got OJ off, I know Mama Carol ain't got that type of money, I know Nicki Minaj does, I'm pretty sure, so, but nonetheless, you know, um, you know, he didn't work, so he was with those kids all day long, and, you know, it also makes me wonder if he was doing this to other kids, you know, telling them, my sister's Nicki Minaj, if you do this or do that, you know, I'll take you places, so, um, or I'll take you places in your life and career, you just gotta do, so, you know, it's just, it's an unfortunate situation, you know, but there are lessons to take from this, you know, always, you can never be too careful with people, and, you know, that's just about all I want to say on this topic. It, make, it just makes me even more sick than I sound right now to even discuss it. But thank God justice is being vindicated. And, um, yeah, he's going to have a hard time in prison because one thing prisoners hate more than being in prison is child abusers and child molesters. So, um, yeah, you're going to make a nice boyfriend in jail, Milan, uh, J Jelani. And, um... Yeah, that's all I gotta say on this. See y'all in the next video. Bye. You motherfuckers, why you still the taboo, motherfuckers? You can get it too, motherfucker. No over this bitch, the kid popping so the fizz. Yeah, I go by young ho, I take over this bitch. Y'all some actors and poses, play your roles and get hit. I will be rap, so I'm. Tell him shout out to my coasters. Yes, I'm quite boastful. Y'all fucking with the kids, shit, I call y'all boastful. Call I at your boy, yes, I'm in my CK. Ain't Zendaya's news, but I stays on replay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, fuck you, babe. Yeah, 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 yeah. Up and lick that down. Each nut nicely. Treat the dick like your prize piece. Excuse me, ma'am. What's your name? I'm imagining daddy. To be respectful. Let me shove it in. No shove. Like red flag. Red flag. Red flag. Red flag. Red flag. Who wait, 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 wait.